Let's start. 어디 있지? 뭐 들어봐. folks this is un my name on youtube channel is fabric monster today i'm going to do a movie about adhesive dribbling this is tutorial with some comedy so if you're thinking of basketball or soccer dribbling you can leave but there's a lot of comedy in there so you can watch them this is fun movie so you can try it there's gonna be few seconds of basketball shown in the video what comes in your mind when you hear the word dribbling Near my place, I found one. 농구 공 파신다고 올린 게 있어가지고. 혹시 언제쯤 아유, 애기 때문에 많이 바쁘신 것 같아요. 어디에 계신지 얼른 나왔어요. 네네, 네, 알겠습니다. 잘 쓰겠습니다. So what is adhesive dribbling? It's a small skill that will help you applying adhesive on fabric or leather. There isn't any specific name for this skill. I just named it adhesive dribbling because Leather Monster, he dribbles chunk of adhesive like a ball. So I named it adhesive dribbling. Synthetic rubber chloroprene star bond Drugs and alcohols are highly prohibited in South Korea But if you want it, please come visit us I'm already getting high So when you use this thing in closed place for long time you get high so but it's you don't need doctor's prescription to buy this so it's official drug I don't know what we're yelling about and this one adhesive holder in Italy they also use this kind of holder I think you can find this one on internet this is how this works okay first you put adhesive here and you can keep adhesive like this when this is not in use you keep them like this and adhesive is gonna be kept in here when you want to use it you put like this and adhesive goes through here and it's gonna be here and you open it and you can dig it with spreader like this And this pointy thing here is um <목소리> 뚜껑이 왜 꼭, 저 꼭지가 꼭지가 왜 이렇게 커요? 아 붓고 보느라고 여기다 꽂고서 이렇게 닫으라고 그러니까 굳으면은 붓이 빳빳해지니까 <목소리> 빳빳해지지 말라고 거기다가 And you can dip the brush tip here and it's not gonna be dried while keeping like this So this is for that use This is glue spreader. This is one Leather Monster bought from market. This one, Leather Monster says it melts down with that yellow adhesive. I think it's not for glue working. 
and these are ones he made for himself. In Korea, it's called Bakuraite, which I think the pronunciation derived from Japanese colonial period. It's called Bakelite, the first artificial plastic, very sturdy, hard plastic, and it is highly resistant to that yellow adhesive we are using, which is also used for electric circuit plates and billiard balls. And let me tell you about this bluish tip of the spreader. See, it's a little bit bluish, transparent, and this one is also very strong. It gets back to its place. And what do you think this is? This is radiographic film. So he made it himself. This is very good for this use. Okay, and there are two kinds of spreader. two kinds of spreader, one with flat corner and the other one with this sawtooth. The difference between those two is that this one can apply thin layers of adhesive on the surface of leather or fabric, while these one with sawtooth can let adhesive go through this sawtooth, making some leftover which makes thicker layer. So good point of using this is that we can make thin layer. But the side effect of using this is sometimes it can be too thin that stickiness cannot be enough. And as you can expect, these kind of spreader are opposite. These spreaders provide thicker layer which can give more stickiness, but the leftover of the adhesive can be a little bit bumpy later. So if you stick something very thin, it's gonna be bumpy, which usually doesn't happen in many cases. So. So mostly he uses this one, and this one with bigger sawtooth, he uses for a bigger panel, he can effectively apply adhesive. Okay, basics of applying adhesive. Basic is simple. In many cases, it is easy to apply adhesive when using corner of your table. If you use corner, it's easier and it's faster and it also helps keeping your desk clean, which can also help keeping your leather and fabric clean too. Let's say this glass is table and this is corner of your table and let's say this is piece of fabric you want to paint with glue. If you put it on the corner like this and let's apply some glue and let's put it away and see how it turns out. It's clean. If you put it in the middle of your table and you want to apply your glue on the corner, how are you gonna do that? You rather have to stop at the corner or you have to go like this, which makes leftover on the table. When you put some fabric or leather on the table, they will be polluted so in many cases, it is pretty good way to put your things on the corner of your table. Now all skills are set. We have learned about adhesive, we know how to use spreader, and we are high. And we know why it is important to put leathers and fabrics on the corner of table. What's left? Let's go get monster. I mean, now we are ready to learn about adhesive dribbling. Okay, heading to the final. So let's start! Adhesive dribbling! The dribbling. 
the most important thing here is that the glue sticks to itself when we when we paint them on the corner of the table when you apply the glue the glue sticks to here because we paint them at the corner so we can paint again again and again but there's one thing you have to be cautious of if you paint them on the surface like this in the parallel the leftover of the adhesive is going to be on the both side here and here which is not supposed to happen so we twist a little bit just a little bit and then paint them there's no leftover rest of the adhesive is going to be stick to here and we can scrub and we can dribble them as you can see that's how it goes it's simple and easy just like this 이거 어디서 배우셨어요? 어디서 배웠냐고? 네. 그러니까 원래 지갑 할때 다 이렇게 몰아서 했었어요 옛날부터. 아 가방도 다 이렇게 했었지. 네. 가방 그 가방 있는 사람들은 더 뻔데 이게 잘해도 지갑 하는 사람들은 그러니까요. 타고 났어. 오케이, okay, this is it for today. Hopefully you found this video informative or anyone who's not interested in crafting also find some fun in this video. Thank you.